that as soon as we get going. Okay. Uh, welcome to everybody who's coming in. Thank you for joining us. We'll be uh, starting uh, shortly after the the welcome session finishes up. Mom, get the door out of here. Now. Go! Um, go on. It's cold. This meeting is being recorded. This meeting is being recorded. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Colby Academy's Open House webinar. My name is Cecilia Dijon Byers. I am an academic advisor here with Colby Academy, and I am blessed and grateful to be with you all this morning. Uh, before we get started, we are going to begin with a prayer. Prayer to the Sacred Heart of Jesus. O oh, Jesus, through the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I offer you all my prayers, works, joys, and sufferings of this day for all the intentions of your sacred heart in union with the holy sacrifice of the mass throughout the world in reparation for my sins, for the intentions of all my relatives and friends, and in particular for the intentions of the Holy Father. Amen. Uh, thank you all again for joining me today. The first thing I wanted to speak to you all about Colby is that Colby Academy is a mission driven organization. We're here to provide affordable, customizable and academically rigorous Catholic education throughout the world with salvation as the ultimate goal. Our flexible approach allows parents to tailor the curriculum to best aid in the, inf in the formation of each child in the Catholic tradition. Uh, Colby Academy was founded as a day school in 1980 by three Catholic families who were very concerned about the decline of education in the public school system and who wanted a wholesome academically challenging environment for their children. 
the founder's goal was to form young Catholic citizens who would effectively defend their faith with a thorough understanding of doctrine and regular reception of the sacraments. They also foresaw the growing need for better, more, and individualized and intensive instruction in basic education. Uh, St. Maximilian Kolbe was chosen as the patron of their new school because of his deep devotion to the Blessed Mother, following the example of St. Maximilian Kolbe, who utilized modern print and radio to spread the gospel. Kolbe Academy is a pioneer in the use of technology to bring quality Catholic education to students around the world. Uh, after the day school began, it didn't take long before families who lived too far away to commute to ask for help with homeschooling their children using the curriculum from the day school. Those first requests in 1987 were the beginning of the homeschool program, and then 30 years later, still going strong, uh, thanks be to God. We've grown quite a bit since then. So in addition to the traditional school at home program for grades K through 12, uh, in 2013, we began offering live online classes for high school, starting with only 15 teachers and 129 students in grades nine through 12. Um, and then live online classes for grades six through eight were added a few years later. And then in 2020, uh, K through five online was also introduced. So now and today, Colby Academy now has over 100 employees with more than 70 teachers. Uh, so the difference of Colby Academy, we offer authentically Catholic classical education in the Ignatian method that is customized to meet your child's needs. Uh, we seek to inform the whole person in truth, goodness, so that every student may find salvation in Jesus Christ. The Ignatian education is founded on the principle that man is born to praise, reference, and serve God our Lord, and by this means to save his soul. Its goal is to form children into adults capable of being Christian leaders in the world. It achieves this goal by teaching children how to clearly and communicate effectively and discern and act upon the will of God in their lives. Our classical curriculum and passionate faculty and staff help to shape every aspect of the child's educational program. At Colby Academy, we take loyalty to the magisterium seriously. So all our teachers and staff take an oath of fidelity to the magisterium and have a profession of faith at the time of hire or renewing their contract. Our classical curriculum also puts emphasis on reading original sources wherever possible. So we teach the greatest works of Western civilization so students can learn to make connections between ancient and modern, which is also the spirit of the church as well. Our rigorous classical approach to education forms the student's mind and soul with a focus on the great works of Western civilization, as well as a premier math and science curriculum. Our offerings of traditional online or self-paced educational programs are customizable to meet the unique learning needs of each child. So we embrace and support the principal subsidiarity. So Colby Academy supports the parent as the primary educators of their children. Uh, with this in mind, we subscribe to the philosophy of the principle of subsidiarity, which means that matters should be handled at the lowest or least centralized level of authority possible. To assist in this, we have designed our program to allow for flexibility in course and curriculum selection, as well as a couple of diploma tracks as well. This allows parents to adapt curriculum to meet the needs of each individual student, and Colby is there to provide support along the way. So the services that Colby provides, uh, we are a full service curriculum provider in school. We offer everything you need to educate your child at home from books and teacher manuals to standardized testing. Parents can enroll students full-time or part-time, and they can choose the amount of assistance they want with the online, homeschool, or self-paced courses. 
Uh, we also offer three ways to educate your children. So in all three models of educating, we believe parent involvement drives student success. In our traditional homeschool courses, Colby offers everything needed to educate at home, such as textbooks, course plans, tests, answer keys, and grading services. In our self-paced courses, which are also homeschool courses, but in a digital format, students watch pre-recorded video classes and follow our online course plans to master each subject at their own pace. In our live online courses, students learn in a virtual classroom among peers with a live instructor who facilitates discussion, lectures, and grades the coursework. Uh, traditional homeschool courses, uh, we provide syllabi, course plans, and exams for you to use as you need, whether it's full-time enrollment or individual courses when enrolled part-time. For our self-paced courses, these courses are video-based and they're created by Colby teachers with self-paced students in mind. So parents, as the primary educators, set the schedule and assign recommended grades. And if you want grading assistance and teacher correspondence, we also recommend our self-paced plus courses as well. Uh, Colby Academy's online program brings a classical and rigorous curriculum onto a digital platform without sacrificing truth, beauty, and goodness that a proper education should provide. So we take pride in our classroom and assignment design in that with targeted live time, we can continue to prioritize pen and paper, physical books, and assignments off the screen. Uh, with our live online classes, students meet with students meet live with peers using the Adobe Connect platform at a set time once or twice per week for a full school year. So instructors post assignments with due dates, hold discuss discussions, and grade student work using Schoology platform. Courses begin in mid to late August and then follow a typical school calendar. Um, and then our live classes are also held Monday through Thursday. At the end of the school year, the grade is reported by the teacher. Um, and then we also offer online courses in all subject areas for grades K through 12, including honors and select AP courses. Uh, so this chart just outlines the number of total hours required for the online courses offered by Colby Academy for the average student. Uh, the hours include both in-class and out-of-class hours. It doesn't include breaks and will vary by student ability, diligence, and focus. So note that if a junior high student is taking high school level courses, he should plan to spend the same number of hours required of the high school course. Um, in this video that I'll be playing just in a second, so it's just about from one of our students explaining their success with having access to primary text in our program. Colby really excels in putting you in contact with primary texts, you know, and primary texts aren't easy to read sometimes, especially when you're a freshman in high school and you're trying to read some of these dense histories, you know, it's like, I don't understand all of this. But you begin to develop your own sense of, of learning and your own sense of inquiry and learning how to navigate that. And that impacts everything that I do every day. I mean, in all these little ways, all these questions that I might have about whether it's politics, whether it's economics, or any kind of topic, theology, um, that's particularly something that I love reading about. So, you know, I mean, I think having that exposure to primary texts has really inspired me, like, and having read, like, the entire theology of the body just on my own one year, you know? So just things like that, just every, every day it impacts, like, the articles that I'm reading, how I'm trying to understand what's going on around me, all kinds of things like that. Wonderful. Colby. We also offer student success in online learning. So to be successful in the online learning environment, there is a certain type of approach and attitude towards learning that is required of students and parents from the beginning. So students should be mature enough to complete assignments with little to no supervision from a teacher. This doesn't mean no instruction, just no supervision. 
Uh, students should also have good time management and study skills. So students should be technologically inclined or at least technologically adventurous to ensure efficient uh, completion of assignments. This includes typing skills, as well as basic knowledge on web browsing, uploading and downloading documents, attaching documents and using word processing software. Uh, keep in mind the number of in-class and out-of-class hours required for the online courses you will be enrolling your child in, and be aware of the total number of hours you have scheduled them. So we have all seen the implications of the overscheduled child, so just be aware of that. Uh, make sure to take into account the total number of classes and required hours you scheduled your child, whether they're uh, online, homeschool, or other classes such as uh, a co-op. Uh, beyond just student readiness, there is also a level of family readiness you should have before having a child in an online course. Uh, make sure you have enough computer power to serve all of the children taking online courses in your household. Sharing computers doesn't work very well for families who enroll children in several online courses at once. Um, and also make sure you be able to provide a quiet study space at home that is easily accessible to you as a parent that provides appropriate space for the student that is free from distraction. Um, uh, to aid in preparing students and families for the online environment, uh, Colby has several programs designed to foster student success. Uh, every summer, we offer a wide variety of courses, including a number of study skills and supplemental uh, courses as well. Uh, in the weeks leading up to the start of the school year, we also require students to complete a full orientation course, which gives them familiarity with Colby Academy's policies, the Schoology platform, and uh, Adobe Connect software. Uh, throughout the school year, Colby provides live support via our academic advising office and tech support ticketing system. At the beginning of the school year, Colby provides a live parent orientation that covers general policies, technology use, and includes an opportunity to hear from experienced parents. Every family enrolled with us will also be assigned a family advisor to assist their family in selecting courses and schooling at home guidance. Um, us advisors are available Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. through 4 p.m. Pacific time via chat, phone, and email. Additionally, our dedicated dean of students can provide support to parents should a student begin to struggle as well. So for high school diplomas, uh, Colby's recommended track is designed as a college preparatory track with the goal of meeting the admissions requirements of most four-year universities. It offers a high level of flexibility and students may opt to follow the Colby curriculum as closely as they desire, including but not limited to our Colby core, Colby honors, um, and all coursework. Uh, students must also fulfill the course requirements by using either Colby courses or other high school or college level courses. If a student is not looking to craft a college prep high school experience, they can also choose to follow the minimum graduation requirements displayed here on this slide as well. Um, a student who would like to earn a diploma should make sure to fully enroll in Colby Academy and choose classes each year to complete either the recommended track or meet Colby, Colby's minimum graduation requirement. All students complete at least 25% of the required credits while enrolled with Colby. Uh, if a student is transferring into Colby Academy in 10th through 12th grade, a transfer student evaluation will be required. Will be required. Um, and then also the diploma types are not awarded based on the student's grade point average or courses selection. Each diploma has a minimum number of courses required in each subject area for graduation. Um, so the types of enrollment that we offer. So Kobe Academy is a full service curriculum provider and school. So we offer everything you need to home educate your child from books, 
teacher manuals, um, and to standardized testing. For full-time students, Colby Academy is your school of record. Um, and then part-time students select the Colby courses they need on an individual basis. Uh, parents can decide after choosing the enrollment type how their student will take classes. So whether that's an online classroom, traditional homeschool class, or self-paced course. You can also opt to mix and match these three course options to meet your students' needs as well. Um, for when you choose full-time online enrollment, your student is typically taking mostly courses from Colby Academy, and Colby will be your student's school of record. Included with full-time online enrollment are any additional homeschool courses up to a maximum of eight academic courses. In, K, in the K through five program um, is a full-time. It includes assignments and grading for all subjects. And then in K through two, all subjects are included in enrollment with core subjects live and additional learning labs each day in reading, writing, and enrichment. In grades three through five, all subjects are included in enrollment with all subjects taught live plus additional homework support time. Uh, there are also two types of full-time enrollment. We have the full-time standard and then the full-time standard flex. The difference is with the standard uh, enrollment, you will receive a bookstore credit and a bookstore draft order. Uh, included with your full enrollment are course plans, tests, record keeping, and having an assigned family academic advisor. Uh, this slide just shows what is included in our full-time flex enrollment. Uh, you will still see that we include in this enrollment course plans, tests, record keeping, and having an assigned academic advisor. Uh, for families wanting to do part-time enrollment, when you enroll a student in a single course, it means that you're not seeking a diploma, diploma at Colby Academy and advisement is limited to only the course or class for which the student is enrolled in. Uh, we do provide a transcript for that single course, which can be sent to your school of record. Uh, we also offer um, a Homeschool Plus program. It is an add-on to our traditional homeschool or self-paced courses for any parents wanting an objective opinion or for those seeking grading help in subject areas out of the comfort zone. Uh, students are assigned an experienced and dedicated evaluator who will okay. give personalized feedback on essay writing, thought development in writing, and test-taking skills. Parents can send in any work within the Colby curriculum for your evaluator to grade. Uh, parents can also submit compositions from outside the Colby curriculum as well. Uh, submission samples can be purchased in blocks of 10, 20, or 50 submissions per student. And you also may purchase additional blocks throughout the school year as well. So for our bookstore, we offer a full online bookstore that requires, or that uh, that carries, sorry, um, all texts, uh, supplemental materials, and many parental resources. Parents can also pur purchase traditional homeschool course plans and all student texts on our bookstore without being enrolled. Uh, discounted used books may also be available for purchase. Um, and for standardized testing, so we also offer standardized testing through the Terra Nova and Iowa assessment programs. We recommend testing your student annually in order to track your child's performance according to national norms. Uh, this just allows you to focus on areas that need an improvement and understand where to best accelerate your student. All, uh, all of our scoring is done in-house using the publisher's software, which allows us to score and return results very quickly. So Colby Academy is a leader in homeschool testing services. So with our competitive rates, along with free expedited results, which makes it convenient and affordable for you to test your child. Uh, you can find more information on these tests on our testing services page on our website as well. Um, so for next steps, uh, to get started with Colby Academy, new students first fill out a short application. 
After that application has been approved, parents can then enroll their students in any of our full or part time programs. At the conclusion of the enrollment process, parents will pay their tuition either in full or on a payment plan through the Blackboard tuition platform. After your payment has been made, you will then receive an email from our admissions team, allowing uh, your allowing you and your student to register, or allowing your students, sorry, to register for their specific courses. Uh, for K through five online students, they do not have to complete the step. New K through five online students will complete a live assessment before being registered for courses. Uh, if you would like assistance in selecting courses, please speak with your assigned academic advisor. Um, and thank you for joining us for today's open house presentation. We do have a full schedule of events today. So up next is our presentation on standardized testing services, followed by presentations on our homeschool and online programs. Uh, we also have an open advising and family rooms for you to meet with our advising staff or with other Coolby Academy families. If you have any questions, um, you can also post this there. Um, and for the next few minutes, uh, we have some time to do a Q&A. Um, so thank you for joining uh, me today. Uh, this was all wonderful to be with you here this morning. Thank you very much, Cecilia. Uh, and thank you to all the families for joining us. My name is Everett Bayarski. I'm the Academic Services Director here at Colby. I've been speaking with some of you in the chat as well. Uh, we do have some time right now. If parents have any questions, if you'd like to uh, either raise your hand uh, so you can speak on microphone or put a question there in the general chat, uh, myself and Cecilia will be happy to answer those. Um, otherwise, uh, thank you for everyone for joining us. It's uh, very happy to have you. As you can see, we have a, a number of events going on today. We look forward to seeing you throughout the day. And again, we do have, we'll have open uh, advisor Q&A available uh, throughout the day, as well as um, that uh, family room for a couple of hours. And you can see the main schedule there. Uh, were there any questions? Uh, question of if there are in-person classes, we don't have any in-person classes at a specific uh, site, um, you know, as all on the lines of a traditional brick and mortar school. But our live online classes are in person in the sense that they are live with the teachers and students present at the same time. Um, so if you're looking for that live interaction, uh, you'd want to uh, join us for one of our sessions later on today. We have the, the online 6 to 12 uh, session at 12.15 Pacific time and the online K-5 session at 1.15 Pacific time. And so that'd be great if you're interested in knowing more about the kind of interactions that are available. Uh, question now, for elementary, are there breaks worked into the schedule? Uh, I assume this is a question about the, the online K-5 through program. Um, the answer is yes, there are breaks worked in. Uh, the other piece is we're very intentional about um, the, the way the, the, the course schedule is designed throughout the day. Uh, your student is not going to be spending you know, all of nine through three in front of a computer screen. We wouldn't that, want that for our kids uh, or for your kids. But for the exact details on the scheduling, I would recommend joining us for that uh, webinar at 115 Pacific time uh, with uh, Ms. O'Connor, who's the director of our elementary program. Um, and, the, uh, and she can talk you through uh, exactly how she has built those schedules to ensure there will be break times to ensure uh, you know, your students are gonna be able to uh, succeed in that environment. Question, are there concerns with online classes for K-5 being full? Uh, last time I checked, we have openings in all of our grade levels as of right now. Um, classes are starting here in about three and a half weeks. Uh, so, and there will be some um, that do end up fill, filled up, but right now we have openings uh, in all of them. So now would be the time to, to get your, those enrollments in um, here in the next week or two, uh, because they will be filling up, especially that, that last week, week and a half before classes start. And I expect that we'll um, have to add people to waiting lists. Question about accessing these sessions. Yes, so we will, are recording all of these sessions. Uh, the sessions will be available um, after this event on our YouTube page. Uh, we'll also be sending them out to everybody who, uh, who had enrolled for, for this event and to our enrolled families. So definitely you can join, uh, you can see view recordings of these uh, later on. I expect we'll have them up um, probably early next week would my, be my guess.
Okay, well, that seems to be it for questions for right now. Again, if you have questions at any point throughout the events, um, you can put, uh, certainly you can place them in chat during the, the various programs uh, and they can, um, and those can be, be answered there. If, uh, but also feel free and join our, uh, the advising Q&A chat, which is gonna be open throughout. So if you have questions and you'd like to speak to one of our advisors, you can certainly do that. I do see there's a question about tuition. So let me put a link to our, um, excuse me, a link to our tuition there in chat. Um, so you can click on it and you'll be able to see pricing information for the, the full-time online program for both K through five and six to 12, uh, as well as the, the full-time standard and full-time flex um, programs, which are homeschool programs, which allow the opportunity to um, add on uh, individual uh, courses. And again, if you want some information on what exactly that tuition includes for each of those programs, um, join us for the upcoming sessions, the homeschool session, which I'll be leading, um, or the online sessions for 6 to 12 or K through 5. And we'll walk through what exactly the, the tuition for those programs includes and how that breaks down. Okay. Thank you everyone for joining us uh, today for, for this, uh, the first of our open house session of providing general information. We'll look forward to seeing you throughout the day at the various sessions on standardized testing, the homeschool program, the online program, uh, and also seeing you in our advisor Q&A and Coley family rooms. Uh, enjoy the rest of your day. God bless. Thank you.